Good morning. Happy, Happy Monday. Happy Monday. From a campground. <laughs> We're actually checking out today. So. Yeah. yeah. Mm -mm -mm. But we had a nice weekend. Yeah, we got to hang out with some friends this weekend. <laughs> it was so fun. Um, Frank and Stephanie and then Vince and Mel. So much fun. We're in Illinois. We found this KOA and we were all kind of in the same area. So it was really nice to get to hang out with them for the weekend. So, yeah, we yeah. so many times we're like all of our friends are in opposite places. And, you know, it's really a treat when we get to meet up like this. And it really is. I mean, we didn't do anything fancy. We just chilled out for chilled the whole out weekend, around the campfire. Really nice. This KOA here is awesome. It was called Rest Up RV Park, but they're changing over to a KOA and they're doing a lot of improvements and, and things here and it's man it, it's a sweet campground it's a really cool place like they have a, a saloon a restaurant a miniature golf course yeah. uh, what else they got over there bunch oh, of bunch of stuff oh, oh a laser stuff. tag laser ta oh, shooting, shooting gallery, a shooting gallery. Um, man so awesome it, yeah but all of that stuff was closed of course because of what's going yeah. on right now so you know there wasn't a whole lot for us to do other than just chill out around the campfire but I, i'll tell you what the employees here were so nice and accommodating they they let us look in the the shooting gallery and yeah. just i mean just brought us so over there nice. all their improvement stuff they're doing over here they're cutting down trees and stuff and they would bring us over uh, the cut down wood and stuff. Yeah. So we we were burning that and we went and bought firewood with from them, which was really cheap. And yeah, we'll definitely leave a link in the description to this place. Yeah. If any of y'all yeah. are out in this area, it's right off the um, I-64. There's a road ranger right here. Yep. So there's yep. a dollar general. So there's stores and stuff. They got True value in oh, case yeah. you need to yeah. do any maintenance on your truck or. <laughs> really, really cool. But yeah. we didn't film at all this whole weekend. We were just wanting to enjoy our time and yeah yeah but it was really nice getting to hang out with them and we, we practiced social distancing as much as we could but <laughs> we did we needed it because we've been out here almost a month now since all this has been going I on know. and it was nice just to get out of the truck <laughs> and this the site we got it's like a buddy site so it was like perfect for all three trucks yeah and there's a cabin here yeah which we did rent that out last night so we could all shower in there and stuff even though we got showers in the truck we used the shower in the yeah, cabin yeah, that yeah, was really yeah. nice yeah. But yeah, we are just packing everything up. They've already checked out. Vincent Mel checked out yesterday because they had to deliver at midnight last night. Yeah. Frank and Steph checked out early, early this morning too because they were heading for a pickup. Our pickup is tomorrow, which you'll find all about in this next in the in this in vlog this actually. video after we get it loaded in the truck. Yeah, yeah. So we had a little extra time here, which was nice. But yeah, we're just packing everything up. Figured we'd jump on, let you guys know what's going on since there probably wasn't a vlog on this last Wednesday because we didn't film anything we for didn't the weekend. Film anything, yeah. <laughs> but sometimes yeah. it's just nice just to to chill and enjoy the time. Let's get checked out. We only got about 90 miles to Deadhead for our pickup tomorrow, which we're gonna knock out today. Yep. Be ready for our pickup in the morning, and you'll find all out. About, uh, you'll find out about it probably in the next clip. Cool. All right. <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you think of our social distancing uh, uh, masks? They're yeah. not really masks, they, <laughs> and they absolutely do nothing. But I think I, I think like <laughs> the success rate on these things are like <laughs> super low. But it's like um, a lot of the places we're delivering and picking up now are requiring masks or some form of face covering. Yeah. Since you can't, we haven't been able to find masks anywhere. No. We no. picked these up yesterday. They said they it has to have something. We have to have something. Yeah, uh, whether uh, a bandana, just some kind of face mask ma covering. Face covering. Cover, so yeah. this is what we picked up. So, this yeah. is what we found at Walmart. Yeah, not bad. I mean, it works. It does the job until we can find something better. Yeah. But we are in, are we still in Indiana? No, we're in Illinois now. Oh, Just Illinois, back in Illinois. Border. Yeah. Well, we picked up in Indiana. We are picked up, tell yep. you about the load now. Yeah. In Indiana, we've got, oh gosh, one pallet at, what was the weight on it? Um, 
200 pounds. 250 pounds, yeah. yeah. We are going to North Dakota, back up into the cold. Forgo, for Forgo. I don't think it's snowing up there though right now. No, it's, it's just cold. Man, it's only in the 40s, I think. Uh -oh. Yeah. oh, got the lawnmower man next to us. He was he was taking a break over here and he just got back on his lawnmower. We're in a rest area, of course. We were We're trying, trying to, to vlog, mister. Hey, you're messing up our vlog, mower man, lawnmower man. So what'd you get? That tree just poked oh, him in the head. It just poked him in the head. <laughs> but hey, we got a backup out in North Dakota after we, we drop. We'll yeah. have to deadhead a little bit for it, but it yeah. does pick up two more. We deliver this tomorrow morning first thing. Deadhead, like 200 miles. We'll, we'll, we'll talk about that tomorrow. Yeah, we'll talk about that tomorrow. But, but yeah, we got at least this one. works looking better than last week, because last week we only had one load. I think this week will only be two loads. You think? I don't know. We might get lucky and get a third one. We'll see. I have high yeah, fr hopes. Friday's good Friday. Friday, though. I know. I didn't even think about that. That that Easter, Good Friday, and Easter is this coming weekend. Yeah, so yeah. I don't know. We might have to find no, another campground. No, no Easter egg hunting for the little ones this this year. No. I mean, I guess people could do it in their backyards. I mean, a lot of people do that anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Like your own family and stuff. And yeah. All right. We had to wait till the lawnmower <laughs> guy got away. He a was like bit. right by the truck. Yeah. yeah right loud. next to the door. So. Yeah. What I was saying. I'm sorry. It sucks for the people whose birthdays and like holidays and stuff are going to spring break. Well, I think all the kids are out of school now, but yeah, like they can't really do anything or go anywhere. I know you want to interrupt. <laughs> Just can't blog these days. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. But yeah. So we are on the road. I'm taking over. I already got my go go juice made. She got Death Wish Bulletproof Coffee. Yeah. She's probably going to knock out the whole 900 miles. <laughs> oh, yeah. We, did we say how many miles? It's like, yeah, no. Oh, yeah. No, no. But we've already so gone. Yeah, I've already uh, gone like 120, yeah. maybe. Yeah, he knocked out a little bit yeah, of it. Yeah, I've been going but... like two hours. Yeah. So. All right. Well, we still need to let the babies out. I'm going to do my pre trip and we'll get on and knock some miles out catch up with y'all tomorrow. To, yeah, get up to North Dakota. Okay. we did was when we got we got picked up and we were heading to North Dakota. Did so we, we need, do a clip? Yeah, we right after we had picked up and in Indiana and we were heading to North Dakota, we were doing our driver swap. That's the last clip we did. That wow. was on Tuesday was and on it's Tuesday. now Thursday. Oh man, we were running <laughs> our butts. <laughs> so we, were... we yeah, so we told you guys we had a backup load after it, we delivered in North Dakota. So. Yeah. It, yeah, it was just kind of a crazy time because we had to get up to North Dakota, got delivered. Then we had to deadhead about two, almost 300, 300, miles 300 miles to pick up our next one in North Dakota. Yeah. And it headed to Oklahoma, which is where we are now. <laughs> yeah. It, man, it was a whip. It was a whip because I, I got us delivered at, at like 730 in the morning on Wednesday. Then we deadheaded the 300 miles. Uh, got there and the pickup turned out to be a huge pain in the butt. Yeah. Uh, we didn't. We got there. Was it like twelve thirty? Didn't get out of there until almost four. Yeah. Um, just yeah. run around headaches there, paperwork, uh, getting trying to even get, get into the place. Yeah, get to a, the place. Yeah, yeah, there was a real secure <laughs> place, and you had to do a background check and. They wanted a picture, and we had to go to another office, and then back to this office. Then the the it was a hazmat load, yeah. and it was multiple hazmats, 
and we started realizing, well, wait a minute, these can't ship together. Yeah. You got you can't ship these together. So it just turned into, yeah, you know, we had a... to have them correct the paperwork and take some things off. And yeah, it was. It was crazy. And we were trying to hurry up and get picked up and out of there because we wanted to get delivered today, Thursday. Yeah. And the agent had told us he thought that they quit receiving here in Oklahoma at one o'clock. And we're like, man, we're not going to make it. We end up calling our contact when, when we got picked up or right before we got when we were waiting to get picked up and we were in North Dakota and he said they were there till like 3 3 30 so well no like, oh. he finally called us back after yeah. like multiple phone calls <laughs> yeah. I called and left a voicemail three hours later never got a call back from him so I sat there and just hit redial 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 and like six times in a row never got an answer and then like five minutes later he calls back did i miss a call from this number i'm like yeah yeah he, he multiple was, calls he was a strange <laughs> character <coughs> oh corona <laughs> yeah he was a strange character because even he was the one who met us to get us offloaded today and but yeah, nice guy yeah. that's what happens in trucking you know i know we make it look real glamorous sometimes and we're having the time of our life out here but a lot of times it's a lot of hard work and it a lot is. of headache that we have to put up with a lot of, of course we can't record during those times right. and you know but at least we can talk about it and share about it you know yeah. I mean, it's work sometimes you know and there's a lot of logistical stuff that just makes you wonder like how do things ever get done i know a lot <laughs> of sitting and waiting and yeah yeah even yeah. to get loaded unloaded yeah. sometimes waiting on loads to get a load it's especially it's, with hazmat i mean it's our job to make sure everything is right but of course the shippers always have an attitude like you're trying to mm -hmm. tell them how to do their job and a lot of times you have to watch them because you know they'll they'll just they get i think they get complacent okay. Yeah, they do. And even though their shipping department, you know, they may ship out hazmat a lot. That doesn't mean that all the paperwork and the way the paperwork has to be is correct. I mean, right. people make mistakes. Right. It's, it's, you know, that happens. And like Jason said, it is our job to check that and make sure what we're picking up is correct. The paperwork's correct. Because with hazmat, there's a lot more that goes into it. You have to make sure the packaging is labeled correctly. Then you have to double check it with the paperwork, make sure it's properly listed said yeah. on the paperwork yeah and, and i mean there's yeah there's lots a lot of steps that, yeah there's more steps we're used yeah. to it so we know what we're doing but right and and if you the driver do not know what you're doing or don't know what to check for and make sure it's correct yeah. it's on you once it leaves the shipper it's your responsibility so even if maybe they didn't do something right once you leave it's on it, you it's on you you can't say oh well it's the shipper's fault because once you leave it's on you so you, on you. you can't go back and be like, oh well, the shipper did it, and they're getting no. It's, sure, they did. You're the one getting the, it up, the but fine you didn't or check whatever. it, and yeah, yeah, DOT catches it. It's all on you. Yeah, so. so you gotta be pretty meticulous on checking everything. But we do have another load lined up. Not till next week. Not till next week. Yeah. Yeah, but we'll talk about that all in the next vlog because we're gonna end this one here. We are gonna head actually. South. It won't be in the next vlog. It's gonna be in the vlog after that. The vlog because, after that because yeah. we're heading south to yes. Texas. Yes. And who knows what we're going to get into. Yeah, who knows? Stay tuned and find out. Probably a lot of truck stuff because yes, our next we, load don't pick up until next Tuesday. Yes, and we, we, gotta, we keep saying, well, we got to get this stuff done. <laughs> we go, oh, we have a weekend. Let's get this stuff done. And we... Well, we were going to do it last weekend, but we ended up camping with friends. And we so were we going to do it the weekend be before, that. but then we were like, no, we just want to be lazy. And <laughs> the weekend before. The and... stuff that has to be done is like not anything major. <laughs> no, that if it's no, not no. done right away, something's right. going to happen. So right, right, that's right. why. But yeah, we'll, we'll probably do that this weekend and kind of show you what little things we're doing. Yeah. So we're going to end cool. this one here. Cool. Stay tuned. See what happens. What we do this weekend to fix. I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys as always for watching and subscribing. And tell our next video. Peace, love, and expediting. What you guys doing? Oh, my hey. babies. The true stars of the show. I know. My sweet babies. Oh, there my they sweet are. Babies. Oh, love my mamas. sweet babies. Love the mamas. Mm -hmm. Thank you.